Hello friends and welcome back to another Happy Mail Monday where I share the glorious mail that has landed in my post box over the past week. Hello! <laughs> good morning, good afternoon, good evening, all that good stuff. Oh wow, I could have uh, used a bit of a longer weekend, I don't know about you, but yeah. Oh goodness me. <laughs> A last Monday comes around and for me at least, um, it is a good day because it is the day I open my mail. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I've mentioned this before, that, that was the one thing I didn't uh, think about before I started doing um, mail openings in that I have to wait to open my mail so no matter how good or, or intriguing or mysterious or all of the adjectives no matter what I have to wait to open my mail sometimes I can't wait especially with parcels unless we get like a special uh, Monday bonus but <laughs> yeah anyway I'm babbling but it's not Monday if I haven't babbled is it <laughs> So today we have two lovely pieces of mail and I will get right into it. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> I don't think my brain has decided what kind of mood it is in uh, yet today, but uh, anyway. <laughs> so first up, we have some glorious mail from Latibule. Hi again. <laughs> so cute. And we have some super cute bunny washi on the back. Oh, goodness me. I just sent out a bunch of mail and had to say goodbye to a couple of uh, my rolls of washi. But such is the way. <laughs> so I have no idea what this is because I was not expecting anything from Latibule. So what? Oh, I can tell you straight away. It's pretty. <laughs> Okay, so make sure we have all the good stuff because Latibu tends to send little goodies and <laughs> including very, very cute. Oh, let's see if I can see this is the problem. This was why I needed to get like a more professional setup. <laughs> but let's see. Bunny wash, hey! So cute! Thank you! Mm. <laughs> I did sit and do that some afternoon make up um, little sampler cards to include in various mailings. I think that's a great idea and I love that let if you drew a little little bunny in there. <laughs> okay. And we have all right. Ooh, okay. So <laughs> hi Nix, how are you today? I am very well, thank you. I hope you are well. I mean I think I'm very well. I think my brain hasn't kicked into gear enough to figure out what's going on. But <laughs> here we are nonetheless. <laughs> Whoops, I made another zine. I know you're not super interested in poetry zines, but I thought I may as well send you a copy anyway. I <laughs> I'm really happy with it. Please let me know what you think. Oh, goodness. Okay, so poetry zines. It's not that I'm not interested in poetry zines. It's that poetry zines and poetry in general makes me a bit nervous in that I always feel like I won't... I'm always worried that I won't understand it. I won't get it. Like, it's, it's just this weird thing. It probably emerged from... Um, oh, what was it? It was something like advanced English or something at uni and what we had a poetry unit and stuff like that and it was just like when I like it I like it and I just <laughs> it's not that I'm not interested it's just I'm afraid I won't understand it that's basically what it comes down to but thank you for taking a chance on me anyway <laughs> I also noticed something I do a lot is make a pretty looking zine, but the title is the complete opposite of it. <laughs> I thought that was a bit weird. I don't realize I'm doing it. Well, that's just part of the creative process, isn't it? You just go with the flow and what comes out comes out. Anyway, forgive me for rambling. No worries. 
I have not slept yet and it is almost 7 a.m. As usual, feel free to show the zine on camera, but please don't show the inside of this one. Absolutely. Oh my goodness. Um, <laughs> go sleep, girlfriend. Get some sleep. <laughs> Sleep is so important. I'm really like the older I get, the more and more and more and more and more I realize how important sleep is. And I know I sound like a bit of a fuddy duddy in that regard, but uh, yes, sleep is very, very important. And I too, when I was younger, um, played around with how much I couldn't sleep. And, and I was, I mean, sometimes I genuinely couldn't sleep, but yeah, one time I stayed up stayed awake for like a week just to see if I could and see what would happen <laughs> don't don't do that don't do that <laughs> anyway now I'm rambling anyway so Ladibule has sent me her newest poetry zine called nuclear winter which has a gorgeous 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 cover Let's see if I can get it to focus <laughs> there we go absolutely gorgeous and I, I, I see what you mean by the whole uh, the title contradicts the uh, visuals of the cover but that just makes it all the more mysterious and interesting I reckon you have a title called nuclear winter and it's covered in flowers and whatnot so people will be curious about the contradiction at least i think so but thank you a lot of you thank you for sending it to me again like it's it's not uh, a a lack of interest or a dislike in poetry it's more just a nervousness regarding poetry and feeling like <laughs> i'm just not intelligent enough to get to understand most poetry but i will have a look and let you know I've actually written some poetry as well <laughs> but yeah anyway thank you Latibule and apologize for my rambling you can feel free to ramble in your notes as much as you want um, that sort of thing happy mail is happy mail and all that good stuff but yes I will try to keep my rambling in the videos to a minimum <laughs> Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Next up from Victoria. Hmm, not, not, that's not the person's name. It's from the next state over, the state of Victoria. <laughs> we have some mystery mail. Hmm, interesting. Fishy. <laughs> I got the fish. That's very cute paper. Don't you reckon? I think so. But then again, I like all the colors as well. The blue and the, and the whatnot. Ooh, this one's well sealed. So I might just do edge up, cut, and back. <laughs> See if that works out on the editing. Okay, this was well and truly nice and secure. And now I've got it open. There we go. Ooh, I really do like this fishy paper. <laughs> Fun, fun, fun. All right, we have, ooh, ooh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, we have a note. Dear Jamie, your blog is always an inspiration. Thank you. Here's a zine I made with my friends. Please give it lots of pats. <laughs> J-E-M Hast. Well, hello, new zine friend, and thank you. I'm glad you find the uh, the blog inspirational. I will take good care of your zine and give it lots of pets. <laughs> okay. Oh, goodness. I just, you know, you mentioned something, and then someone mentions it later, and I'm like, I can't remember even where I first um, mentioned zine. I, I, pet, I pet the zines. <laughs> so... From J.E.M. Hast, we have Beanstalk Volume 1. Dun, da, da, da. Oh, that's cool. Paper cutout type deals. The Hat Edition. Ooh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. Greetings, dear readers. It is my pleasure to welcome you to the inaugural edition of Beanstalk. Oh, okay. 
Why Beanstalk, you ask? Why? Well, there are three artists who put this scene together. Our names are Jess, Annie. Oh, I'm gonna be bad at this. Jess and Anime. Oh goodness. A double N E M I E K. So, I'm sorry I messed that up. And Cassidy, put those together and you get J A C. <laughs> now say it out loud. Thus we arrived at J A C, Jack and the Beanstalk. <laughs> Very nice. So this looks like a, cre uh, a uh, excuse me, a combination of art, collage, paintings, a few written things, lots about hats, which is very fun, more art, and I don't have permission to show anything inside, but I think it'll be totally okay to show you the intro and the uh, table of contents and the uh, contributing people. Hello, hello, hello. And sorry again for messing up the one name. I'm so sorry. Ugh. Anyway, <laughs> thank you so much for sending this along. It's it's very intriguing. I, li I like the, um, the mix of different art, different art styles and hats. Hats are fun. Love it, even a written piece as well. Okay, cool. Thank you so much. Oh, goodness me. And thank you so much for the lovely now. It really, <laughs> really makes my day to know that people are finding use and pleasure and joy and all that stuff like that with uh, the various things I do. So yes, thank you. Oh my goodness. I'm just so... Huh. <laughs> Love it. There's this one um, picture I keep going to. It features a mushroom. <laughs> oh, I wish I could show you. But again, I get I just get a little bit weird about these things, so you know, I'd rather play it safe and that sort of thing. So thank you so much to Jack and the Beanstalk and to J E M for sending it along and thank you so much to Latibule for taking a chance on me when it comes to your poetry zine. I greatly appreciate it so so much. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, such unique zines landing in my post box this week. I'm looking forward to checking them both out. But, you know, it's me. There's zines. How could I be anything other than enthusiastic when it comes to checking them out? <laughs> I will wrap this one up here. Keep it short and sweet and all that good stuff. We'll see how things go. How mail goes as we draw closer uh, to the end of the year. There is the end of the year mail crunch and all of that good stuff. But we'll s see what happens, see how it goes. Maybe if uh, there's no mail that comes in, uh, I'll have to come up with something else for videos. But um, yeah, thank you, thank you. I honestly didn't think <laughs> much at all would come in the mail. Um, until the beginning of next year and here we are Latibule and Gem. Gem? Can I shorten it? I hope I can. <laughs> thank you both and thank you for watching and thank everyone who subscribes, watches, listens, um, supports me on Patreon, all of that good stuff. Thank you a million times. Thank you. Like, Oh, I say, I say something along these lines every week and I just feel like I'm not fully expressing, <laughs> not a um, accurately expressing how happy this makes me and how lucky I feel to be in this place and time where people are sending me such glorious, wonderful zines to have a look at. Mm, thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful week ahead. Deep breaths, not so much stress if you can avoid it. I know this time of year, it's, it's this time of year. So yes, deep breaths, find a mental happy place. <laughs> we can do it. And until next time, send some mail, spread some sunshine, take a deep breath, make some zines, and have a wonderful week.
Do you like my coffee mug? I don't know if the camera's gonna pick it up all that well, but it's a it's a sea green and I love it and it has flowers on it. And yes, this is what we've come to for the after credits stuff. <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm very, very tired. And this looks very, very strange. <laughs>